Hey guys, my name is Chanel Cruiser. I'm an artist and I wanted to show you guys um, how to gallery wire your artwork. Um, when I first started, I had a really hard time finding any videos. Um, so it's really easy. Um, I'm actually doing this painting that's a nine by 12. Um, it's a wood frame and most of your canvas, well, all of your canvases are going to have wood behind them. So you can easily screw in. Um, <clears throat> you're either going to do some actual just screws, right? Just a normal screw, or you can get these little, um, screws that have a loop on them and you can get these at any art supply store and so you definitely want to measure make sure that both sides are correct otherwise um you know your your painting is going to be off so i measured these and um let me make sure i measure yeah okay they looked off in the video so anyway um once you get your screws in or these loops Another, so the three things that you're going to need are your screws or a loop. Make sure that if you buy these loops that you read on the package how much weight it can hold. Um, because if you have a larger painting that's um, really heavy, you need to make sure that these are going to hold, right? Um, another thing that I do for larger paintings, I get some really, really big um, screws and my husband will put those into the back. So once you have your screws or your loops, you're going to need some aluminum wire. I get this um, from Hobby Lobby, any art supply store will do. So once you get this, you're going to need um, your wire cutters. And so what I'm going to be doing is, um, so here's the loops. I hope you guys can see this. Okay. So once you do this first little loop, right, all you're going to do is wrap this around in circles. And that's, it's pretty simple, but honestly, I couldn't find anything online um, when I was searching for this, right? So you're going to wrap, 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 make sure this guy's not going anywhere. So let me show you what that looks like. So see, and then you're going to want there to be enough room to where this can hang, but you don't want it to be too high either, right? So then you're going to go ahead and cut your other end. Let's do right here. Okay. You guys can see everything I'm doing. So now you have this right wrapped around, and then you're gonna go over here, right? And I don't want it to be too loose, so about right here is good. So once you get to this side, you're just gonna loop this around to where it's nice and tight. And then you're going to just keep looping. And I actually like to have um, some of this left over because it's not going to do you any harm to just, you know, have it like more secure, really. Um, I like to have a little bit left over that I can just wrap around and keep wrapping. And the really cool thing about this, too, if you decide, you know what, that's too loose, that's too tight. It's super easy to take off and then just redo it. And then another thing you want to be really um, careful about too is make sure that this wire, um, it will say, it should say on the package, yeah, 50 pounds. So these should say on the package because there's different type of wiring, right? There's some that's going to be a little bit thinner, a little bit thicker. I always just like to go a little bit thicker I just feel like it's safer. Um, I'd rather do that than have someone, you know, I, I really don't think these are going to pop and break, but who knows. So anyway, there you go. There you have it. And that is how you gallery wire your artwork. There you go.
So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is my first video to put on YouTube. Um, I'm going to start doing a little bit more of these and hopefully you find the information useful. Um, you can find me on Instagram at Chanel Cruiser Official Art. And um, yeah, bye guys. Have a good day.